Playing truancy is like breaking the law. You get a demerit point out of that. Dad, dinner's ready. Uh, Dad? What happened? It's Dad. He's, he's... Oh... Snooky. No, honey. The Lord. Mushroom Kingdom Married by the Mystery Melody, The Blurs. It comes without warning. First you balloon to blip size, then the rolling. You roll away. This is the horror of the blobs. <laughs> As the first time, the cause and kill are obviously unknown. Day by day, the number of blob totes swell. Seeing how grave the situation is, Peach convenes an emergency meeting at her castle. You hear some stupid texts about toads and their bloat chits and this weird star sprite which is known as Starlo and I don't really give a dang. <laughs> yeah, Captain Obvious. Yeah, hope and Dios. So, um, where are the My Real Brothers? Yay, a triumph on entry. Yahoo! Luigi! Yeah. Luigi, you're such a douche. Don't be a douche. In work on your triumphant ending, uh, uh, introduction. I don't need to worry about that. Basically, this is your fir my first RPG walkthrough, and you're gonna have to control Mario and Luigi with A and B. You can talk to some toads, and for now, you can only jump or talk to the toads. So around here, there are a bunch of coins. The, at this area, you should get um quite a number of coins, about 16. In the next area, you get another. Some coins are uh, 17, and the next part you get 5 coins. These 22 coins are easy to get, so you want to make it the most out of these coins. Um, turning that way will lead to another part of the castle, but we cannot access there as of this point because we are not far in the game. We will come back here far further in the game. So, walk around and realize that you have nothing to do, time to go into the conference hall. Fellow in a cape. The instruction manual already know who that guy is. And it is not Bowser. Bowser is the protagonist. Ironically enough. Anyway, after this, you shall get your first training battle, which is surprisingly a boss battle. It's pretty, really much of a training rather than a boss. So, um, yeah. Yeah, Peach, you should support Bowser. Shut up, Starlo. No one is interested in you. Nah, I don't need your help, Toadsworth. I've played this game before. When you attack, make sure you attack when you, like, stomp on Bowser, 
you hit A. You cannot let it go on autopilot. If you do, uh, you will not do powerful attacks. Try to get excellent because you will need to know how to do excellent. Next time, um, a lot later in the walkthrough for many different attacks. This is Bowser's very basic attack. And see, I only got a great there, darn it. I'm an expert. To do that, this is the first Bowser. There are, there's a second Bowser and a Challenge No Day Bowser, and that one I'll get to that later, a lot later in the game. But for now, we'll just do this. Basically, this is just a training fight. It's not really much of a boss fight. You have to deal with 50 HP. And uh, all he does is use is flame breath. You have 24 HP at your disposal. Keep repeating. It doesn't matter. That's considered very little HP. This fight just teaches you the basics of fighting. Once you drain his HP, like 50 down, you can easily destroy him. What happened? Where are my skills? That was not my A game. You have Bowser, you should be like totally owning Mario. Oh well, sadly, I wish I could battle with you. <laughs> well, we're gonna do that eventually. We're gonna battle with Bowser, but not against the Mario Brothers. Ooh, sh that hurt. Now there's a hole in the castle. Thank you, Mario. <laughs> Thank you, Mario. That sounds so fake and gay. <laughs> This is Dimblewood, although we, we haven't really unlocked this area yet. We, we can only go to one spot because we haven't learned the sliding attack, which we will learn eventually when we come back to Dimblewood. And that's gonna be in a while's time, not now. Anyways, this is Dimblewood and it's the forest. This is where Bowser just woke, woke up and being a uh, douche and hating Mario no matter what. What's the problem, Kamek? Is that Kamek or Maggie Cooper? Yo, uh, use X to punch and Y to burn using fire. You will lose these abilities, so, yeah, you will eventually lose these abilities. You wanna punch that rock? And maybe, just need to punch these two. And you're good to go. Then you gotta burn these these trees. And then your job is to make your way this way. You meet this weird dude in a cape who's being a douchebag. Yay! 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 That sounded retarded. Yeah, do not worry. Just eat that thing and die. At least pass out. Bowser, you naive a-hole. You're such a douche. Eat. Chomp, 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 chomp. Puff. Puff? It's a vacuum machine. Powerful, you know the little thing from Superstar Sega. Can't believe it's you. Well, actually, I can't because it's written in the instruction manual that it is powerful. You should have expected it's powerful anyway, so that's not. The meeting must go on. Sleeping shorty and time meeting and you're not even aware that Bowser's outfit attacks you. Come on, 
Let the windy air vent it to Super Mario 64 DS. Yeah. I'll try. I'll try it. Victory, easy as quick damages. Awful calls you.